Happy New Year, everybody. 2021 is here. Thank sweet God that is the case. I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday, a staycation holiday, whoever you were with, family, friends, however you celebrated. I really hope it was restorative and peaceful and filled with love. Mine was, and I'm very grateful for that. Also, of course, there were many challenges over the holidays for me and my family, and I'm sure there were for you and yours, and there will continue to be, because we're at where we're at. It's a new year, but we're at where we're at. And for actors, there are a lot of things right now that are unknowns that we are powerless over. God, as actors, we've always been powerless over so much. As human beings, we're always powerless over so much. But I think many actors right now are facing, wait, when am I making money? And how am I making money? And when is it coming back? And is it coming back? And is it come? I think it's back for my friend. They had an audition. Or how does the audition? Or what does it work? Or when were they shooting? Or what should I do? How do I get an agent? Do agents exist? All this stuff is happening, right? All these questions. And there is one thing we have power over that I'm going to encourage you to focus on in a real way and challenge you to focus on over the next two weeks. We have power, you have power over creating. You can create. Today, right now, after you watch this video, you can begin to create something. Actors are artists and they create. And if as actors, we are waiting for the permission to create, or we're just trying to get, or trying to achieve, it gets really gummed up really quickly. Creativity always provides more guidance, and more clarity and more empowerment. But real clarity and real guidance and real empowerment, which is not false perfection, which is not knowing the thing. It's something the intellectual man, the intellectual mind can't fully grasp the kind of intuitive guidance and intuitive clarity, clarity and real empowerment that we get from creating, to create something, not think about it, not think about creating, not God, why if my agent would just get me the audition. I could work on it. Don't wait for that. I challenge you to choose something today, to sit down after watching this video and choose something to create that involves your acting skills. It can be working on a monologue. It can be writing a monologue. It can be writing a comedy sketch. It can be writing the outline for a short film. It can be getting together with that friend to brainstorm an idea for the screenplay you want to write. Choose something. Don't overthink it. Keep it simple and doable. Something that if you do a shitty imperfect 20 minutes on every day for the next two weeks, you can do it. You can have taped that monologue. You can have written a rough draft of that monologue. You can have written the comedy sketch. You can have an outline for the short film. Something doable that you can create. Choose it today and over the next two weeks, spend at least a shitty, imperfect 20 minutes every day working on that thing. And keep it in your back pocket throughout the day. So when you get jammed up, when you get frustrated about the conversation you had or you didn't have with an agent or you don't know how to get an agent or you're just whatever is going on and kind of eating you alive, you can drop everything and create. You can drop what you're doing and spend 15 or 20 minutes working on this very, very doable thing and do it for the sake of doing it. Don't go like, oh, well, can I show it to my agent? And can I like, blah, blah, blah. don't even worry about that. Treat it like a, a Buddhist sand mandala. There are Buddhist monks who will spend like six months on a beach creating the most beautiful sand mandala you've ever seen. And as soon as they finish it, they immediately carry it over to the ocean, which is 20 feet away. And they watch the ocean just immediately destroy all their work. 
So approach it with that attitude. I'm just doing it to do it. I'm doing it to taste the dimension of creativity in a mainlined way. I'm not saying don't keep working on getting an agent or don't talk to your agent or do whatever, but give yourself this pure, fun, simple, creative thing to do and do it for the fun and do it for the love and see what happens. See what kind of guidance, see what kind of clarity, see what happens in your heart if you in a real, simple, gentle, but firm way commit to this creative act for the next two weeks, for 14 days. I challenge you to do it. Create, create, create. And I hope this year brings you love and fulfillment and more and more creativity, which you are responsible for, the creativity. I promise you can do it. Okay. Thanks so much. I hope to connect with you soon.